Welcome to this week's Bayou Country Outdoors with your host Susan Melton and Maurice Fontenot. Cachada Casino Resort, Louisiana's best bet. Meads Automotive Service and Sulphur, reliable and professional service. Gordon McKernan, Injury Attorneys, get Gordon, get it done. Lakeside Bank, the way banking should be. Wings, cooling and heating, total home comfort is what we do. Like Charles Poultry, where service is just like an old-fashioned meat market. Outdoor Adventures Productions, digital video and photographic services for television, commercial and industrial applications since 1993. And now it's time for this week's Bayou Country Outdoors. Hello, I'm Maurice. In recent years, fishing at night for speckled trout has become more and more popular. While most of it is done from lighted piers and wharves, some of the fishing guide services offer nighttime trips from party barges rigged with generators and lights. Under the bright lights, small bait fish are drawn to the swarms of insects the lights attract. All this activity is a magnet for feeding specks and reds. Anything that wiggles or is bright and shiny will get fish strikes. However, the best is usually live shrimp or pogey shad. The other great advantage to fishing at night is beating the daytime heat of southern Louisiana. We want you to stay tuned as Susan and I have a great speckled trout trip fishing from a pier under the lights. Cachada Casino is bigger and better than ever. Experience the new Seven Clans Hotel and Dream Pool with a lazy river. Choose from over 2,800 hot slots, 70 table games, nine dining options, the region's best entertainment, plus bingo, off track betting, and live poker. All served with true Louisiana Southern hospitality. When you add it all up, Cachada Casino Resort in Kinder is Louisiana's best bet. Welcome to Lakeside, how may I help you? Yes, what do you charge to cash a check from one of your customers? Absolutely nothing. Really? No fee? Zero. Zilch. It's completely free. I'm impressed. The bank down the road wants to charge $6 to cash one of their customers checks, and that's just wrong. You're right, that is wrong. Here at Lakeside Bank, we don't believe in charging you to do business with our customers. Well, that's what I told the other bank. Lakeside, the way banking should be. The air inside your home is up to five times more polluted than the air outside, resulting in increased health problems. As we tighten our homes to make them more energy efficient, we trap in air pollutants. With the installation of air quality products available from Wings Cooling and Heating, you can actually smell the difference. So contact us to improve the quality of your home life. Lake Charles Poultry has a second location, offering more convenience and longer hours, but still the freshest meats at the best prices. Service like an old-fashioned meat market, Lake Charles Poultry, Highway 90 East and Hobby Lobby Shopping Center in Lake Charles. Handling a gator like this can be scary, and this is pretty risky too. 
But do you know what's really dangerous? Dealing with the insurance company after your car wreck. If you've been injured, get a fighter. That's why you need to call me. I'm not afraid to handle them, and I'll fight to get you every dollar you deserve. So if you've been hurt, hire a professional. Just call me. Get it done. Get Gordon. Get it done. Call 888-8888 or go to getgordon.com. At Angelo's Fireworks, there's no more wondering what a firework will do or what the display will look like. Each of Angelo's 12 locations are now equipped with handheld scanners and TV displays that allow you to scan and see the firework in action. Or you can download the mobile app and scan at the store. Even better, you can view at home and make your list before you arrive. Just go to the App Store and download the Backyard Preview app from Jake's Fireworks and get ready to improve your fireworks fun. And remember, don't you find the overpriced fireworks! Angelo's has a Foles of Honor big 500 gram fireworks where $10 of every purchase goes to benefit the families of killed or disabled American military personnel. There it goes. Get him? Yeah. Whoop. Whoop. So much for that. Probably tangled up my line. Oh, yes, they like to do that. All right, what do you got? Cool. Another one, great. Good, good, good. Ooh, look at throw all that goop. Yeah, that's good. Got my rag over here. Mm hmm. Don't kick my pole over now, be careful. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. We got that catch net. Where James put that? Right here. Okay. They go and get the shrimp. All right, I'm gonna go back to yeah, mine. A keeper. He's your keeper. I guess we're throwing him back, no, right? No, catch that oh. over here. I tell you what, it's nice to be under a roof when it's raining like this. Yeah, it's not a hard rain. It's a little drizzle, but after about 30 minutes, though, you'd be wet. Yeah, if you were in a boat, right? Up. Oh. That's all right. I've been doing that too. That's where the fish are. They're on that side over there. All right, let's see. Oh, I hope I don't get one. Because <laughs> then I have to cross no, over I'm, you. That's, I'm no, gonna... that's all right. I'm way out there. Don't worry about it. The current's going to move it anyhow. Oh, there he goes. Got it? Yep. I got him. I got him. I got him. Yeah. Oop. Well, where is he? There he is. <laughs> He's dancing. Oh, well, that's a little speck. It's a speck. I speck so. A it's speck a so. speck. <laughs> Boy, he was hungry, dear. Those hunting. pliers over here on the deck. Well, I'm gonna, oh, okay. I'm right gonna there. need some here. Mm. Hey. Be 12 inches. Do you have something to measure it yeah, with? Yeah, top of that. Oh, we don't have it here anymore. James took it. Susan, it's really raining now. <laughs> oh, so you think those fish are still going to bite? Yeah, I think they will. All right, let's see. Oh. All right, fish, come on. Let's see. Here, you want me to grab the camera? <laughs> this is... <laughs> Get yours. <laughs> Folks, we got two of them on. All right, Reese, come on, get yours in. Yeah, we got a double whammy uh, they here. They hit at the same time. I th yep. What happened since I think there's schools of fish coming through because we went a few minutes there and nothing hit, and then all of a sudden everything started hitting. And I'll tell you what, I'll take yours off. That'll be cool. No matter what, if it's raining, huh? Yeah, well, those fish are down underneath. Well, hey, we want to. Um, I want to 
say thanks to Marshall Spicer. It's Spicer's Bait and Tackle. He provided the shrimp. And you know, isn't that something? Telephone will not even let you uh, let you fish. Let's see who's calling. The daughter. Hello. We're catching fish. What you want? <laughs> yeah, she's right here with me. Okay, well, we're, we're filming a show, babe. Why was she worried? Oh, okay. Well, okay, she was worried about you because you come straight fishing. <laughs> okay, love, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Yeah, I told her, I said, I got to get over this fish you're biting. They need me. Isn't that something? A fish stuff bite? Oh, hey, he spit the hook on his own. Great. Hey, That'll man. Work. That That's a cooperative work. spec. And I guess, I guess I'm going to be stuck with rebaiting two hooks, huh? Yeah, that's, well, that's okay. I don't mind. Show the shrimp over here. Didn't we? All right. Get some nice live shrimp. These guys look they look pretty good. They're not real large, but the we found tonight that the fish are on the smaller mm -hmm. on the smaller shrimp. Yeah. Hey, there's one if you're lucky you'll live. <laughs> here, go in between the cracks. Go, go, go. All right. Chum. Mm. Not bad, huh? Oh, yeah. A little white trout. Yeah, it looks like a little white trout. I'm just going to throw him back. Now, is there any size to the white trout? I don't trout? think there is. Uh, I haven't checked the book this year, but uh, we're not keeping any whites because they're not very big. Hey. Actually, actually probably better eating than expect. Ah, uh, spit. back. Give it to me. <laughs> Your shirt's wet. What's that, from the rain? Yeah. Yeah, I've been getting a little wet here. I don't care. I'm catching fish. This portion of Bayou Country Outdoors is being brought to you by Meads Automotive with over 63 years of reliable service featuring complete automotive and truck repair, state-of-the-art computer diagnostics, and free estimates. Located at 1548 East Napoleon Street in Sulphur. Every home has air quality problems with odors in the air from cooking, pets, germs, and chemicals. As we tighten up our homes to make them more energy efficient, we inadvertently trap in air pollutants. With the installation of air quality products available from Wings Cooling and Heating, you can actually smell the difference. Contact us to improve the quality of your home life. Charles and Sulphur. An over-the-counter old-fashioned meat market. That's the best way to describe her, Lake Charles Poultry. They create all kinds of meats and seafood, and it's all fresh. They sell to both wholesale and retail customers specializing in large order for groups and benefits with the meats cut and seasoned order. The freshest meats and the best prices at Lake Charles Poultry. At Angelo's Fireworks, there's no more wondering what a firework will do or what the display will look like. Each of Angelo's 12 locations are now equipped with handheld scanners and TV displays that allow you to scan and see the firework in action. Or you can download the mobile app and scan at the store. Even better, you can view at home and make your list before you arrive. Just go to the app store and download the Backyard Preview app from Jake's Fireworks and get ready to improve your fireworks fun. And remember, don't you buy no overpriced fireworks! Angelo's has a Foles of Honor big 500 gram fireworks where $10 of every purchase goes to benefit the families of killed or disabled American military personnel. Need a car? United Auto Brokers can help. Easy financing, low down payment, and 0% interest. Your job is your credit at United Auto Brokers. Gerstner Memorial Boulevard, Lake Charles. What? what? Yours what? was going down. No, it's just, just let it be. Just worry about yours. Well, the mine was wrapping up in yours. Well, mine, it may have been wrapped up. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Good, good. Okay, here, let's fish. let's keep it going. All right. Let all me right. get back out there. You go you ahead probably, and take your You probably off. lost your bait. That's okay. what I'm saying. I'm sure I lost my bait. Up oh, there it went. I gotta go. Ah, oh, <laughs> it went down. Hurry. I'm trying. I'm trying. Come on, big boy. Ooh, he's mad. He's like, I got caught. Oh, ah, good one, huh? 
Woo! That's how they get your. Yep. Your line all messed up, jumping around like that. All right, I know you're mad. All right, I finally got it loose. <laughs> all right, let's make it in the catch bag. Yeah, he did it. Okay, is this your towel? Yeah. I'm clean. borrowing it. <laughs> it's clean. Yeah, that other one's pretty slimy. <laughs> Show what I just did. <laughs> oh. Show them. How can I show them? Just lift up and that beam up there. <laughs> Point up there. Point the camera up there. That beam, guess what? It's lower in my head. <laughs> oh. <laughs> mm. Fish, you you sure put me through a lot. That was my fish that did it to you. Oh well. We're a just making did. good for it. And so this is you got you a hook. fish out of the deal. Now <laughs> oh. don't go fall. <laughs> this Woo. man falls so gracefully. Hat fits better. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I mean I I it felt like popcorn going off in my head when I hit that thing. Golly. I gotta he swallowed that hook. I gotta get me a new hook. Oh, missed it. I set in too quick, but I still have my bait. You seen that? Yeah. Well, sometimes a small fish will do that to you. We caught a couple of banana fish before you got out here. And they'll, they'll jerk it under and take off and never get the bait. Wow. Hey, someone was telling us the other day that those banana fish are good bait. Yep. We were right. always wondering what they were good for. Yeah, he said he was cutting them in uh, the sides into ribbon pieces like when yeah. we were catfishing. Yeah. He was catching redfish with it. Nato. Come on, fish. Ooh, that one was a big explosion back I there. I saw that. There's some big fish moving back over on the out outside edge of this light. And the fish got on there. Oh, yeah. All right. That's keeper. If he'll let me keep them, if he won't go. All right, settle down now. <laughs> yeah, he's a keeper. Yeah, you measure up, honey. In the bag. I like that what bag. What we got in about eight or ten now? Something like that. We're doing okay. Get me another shrimp. Those little needle fish, they'll rob you and you'll never see your cork move. That's why it's good to have plenty of shrimp, huh? Yeah, we got three quarts tonight. Thanks, Marshall. How's he doing? I didn't see him. You didn't get to see Marshall? Mm -mm. No needle fish, you're not getting my bait. Neither is the speck. Rachel, you're yegging that thing well, in. I moved it. Hey, I told you I seen him moving around up here. You know, there it goes. Oh. All right. Never mind. Where did it go? <laughs> oh, shit, it hooked that light. Maurice, there's no fish up there. <laughs> no fish here is a bright light. I mean, there's a little bitty keeper in that thing, and that's where the hook is. And I, oh, there we go. Did I, you I have was a just fish? turning around looking. I was hanging this thing right here, and that speck hit it right here. You set the hook, huh? Yeah, and but the you know light. what? This is one of those little 97 cent spoons. I'm beginning to think that's the fourth fish I've lost. I'm going to think these things aren't, these hooks aren't sharp enough, but they certainly appear to be. They're just not staying on. Huh. Need to put some of those Gamagatsu treble hooks on there. I know they'll stay on those. Yeah. See if you can get another one on it. That's, that is four fish I've hooked on this and hadn't got the first one in. Um, I just threw rattle trap for the first time, and I've caught. A, I've hit a few on spoons, but they haven't. They haven't hit it hard enough to stay on it. Well, that's a nice one. Yeah, you didn't you show us that one. one. Yeah, that's a yeah, good one. Better than yours. All right, now we're doing what's better. Well, yeah. <laughs> I tell you what, this towel. That's the this slime towel. It is. It's a slime towel. 
there's so much fun to catch. Just so much fun. You can tell Maurice is a true fisherman. He didn't want to go in after he banged his head. this can be scary and this is pretty risky too but do you know it's really dangerous dealing with the insurance company after your car wreck if you've been injured get a fighter that's why you need to call me I'm not afraid to handle them and I'll fight to get you every dollar you deserve so if you've been hurt hire a professional just call me get it done get Gordon get it done call 888-8888 or go to getgordon.com the air inside your home is up to five times more polluted than the air outside, resulting in increased health problems. As we tighten our homes to make them more energy efficient, we trap in air pollutants. With the installation of air quality products available from Wings Cooling and Heating, you can actually smell the difference. So contact us to improve the quality of your home life. If you're looking for a hearty lunchtime meal that is both hot and quick, let us suggest some local favorites. Hayes Cajun Kitchen and Hayes Cajun Diner, both featuring lunchtime buffets and salad bars with a different menu every day. Hot food ready to eat when you walk in the door or you can call in your order. That's Hayes on Roof Street or Hayes on City Service Highway in Sulphur. The Hard Hat Cafe, located just behind Circle K in Westlake, opens at 4 a.m. with breakfast and ready-to-eat brown bag lunches to go. Lunchtime features fried chicken, hamburgers, po' boys, fried fish and shrimp, salads and gumbo. That's the Hard Hat Cafe in Westlake. Shot of your fish. This one is not going to make 12 inches. So okay, we'll put him back. Let me read you out. He feels good. He feels good. He looks good. If I could get him. <laughs> All right. He's a keeper. He's your keeper. Hey, he was barely hooked. Now see that. Barely hooked. So that's why you got to bring him in. Oh, he made it. Good. He made it in. I'm going to wash my hands in here. That's what I'm doing. In the shrimp? Yeah. I mean, it gets some of the slime off. Give it back to him. Yeah, you have some flavorful hands, I'll tell you. Well, yeah, because then what you do, if you, you have your hands too slimed and you wipe it on the towel, then it gets real bad. That's what happened to that white one over there. Yeah, I know. It's, it's, you could use so, it for bait. I mean, just rinse your hands in that. Why not? Good hey. tip. Good tip. I gave you, tell you, you can use that white towel for bait. I'm going after another good shrimp here. I want a big shrimp. That'll do. <laughs> All right. Now to find the hook. What I've been doing is throwing it over the side so yeah. I can find it and things don't get so raveled up here. You know. All right, and I'm just hooking it right there, and he's ready to go. Oh, maybe not. I don't know what I did. There. Thanks for the help. <laughs> All right, let's go. Okay, I didn't throw it too far, but... May, up, 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 there it goes. Oh, yeah, here we go. And I didn't even throw it out that far. Have you seen that? Yeah, I know. They, there's a group of them back in Like you now. said, they're like going in spurts. Yeah, they're, they're coming through in little groups and schools. And 
Eh, 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 eh. Use and that it, towel. I don't want it you It won't thin. do any good. Ooh, he just threw up. <laughs> <laughs> he did. Air sick. Eh, 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 eh. He's mad. Oh, he's throwing up again. Oh, looky, looky what he threw up. <laughs> oh, look, he just threw out another one. They're gorging themselves. Look, that's now, you're talking about a tip. There's a tip. Let's see what a fish is throwing up. You know what to fish with. Glass minnow and a shad. Yeah, I had one while ago, threw up a live one. Man, these are tough. And I don't want to break That's those my thin hook. wire hooks, and a lot of people don't like to fish with them, but they um, they don't come out easily. No, they don't. Look. But look at he threw up this little fish and that one. And guess what? He's going in our bag. Do you want to be the last one? Oh no, it ain't gonna be the last one. I can tell you that right now. It's not gonna be the last one. Maybe the last one on tape, but it's not gonna be the last one. Connect with Susan De Maurice's Bayou Country Outdoors now on YouTube. Simply log on to YouTube and in the search box type Bayou Country Outdoors. You'll find many of our outdoor hunting and fishing tips you've enjoyed in the past, plus some episodes of Bayou Country Outdoors. New videos are being added each week, and we encourage you to share these links with your friends. Thank you for watching this week's Bayou Country Outdoors. with your host, Susan Melton and Maurice Fontenot. Cachada Casino Resort, Louisiana's best bet. Meads Automotive Service and Sulphur, reliable and professional service. Gordon McKernan, Injury Attorneys. Get Gordon, get it done. Lakeside Bank, the way banking should be. Wings, cooling and heating. Total home comfort is what we do. Lake Charles Poultry, where service is just like an old fashioned meat market. Outdoor Adventures Productions, digital video and photographic services for television, commercial, and industrial applications since 1993. Bayou Country Outdoors is a production of Outdoor Adventures Productions and is produced and directed by Maurice Fontenot and Susan Melton. You can contact us by writing to Outdoor Adventures Productions, 1019 Shady Lane, Westlake, Louisiana, 70669, or by calling 337-439-4063.